House Rules New Zealand smashed onto our screens like a sledgehammer through a wall. A wall that was blocking natural light from getting into a spacious living dining area. The first house that you guys will be renovating belongs to... g Man Alvaro from Glen Eden. Friday. Five teams, five homes and five house rules to stick to. The one. Use Scandi with Coastal in a modern way. And with only five and a half days to complete each home, the contestants were under the pump. From cabinet calamities to wallpaper woes. I like this. Do you like that? It's very sparkly. It's texture. It's colour. Hopefully they love it as much as you do. But through all the dust and debris, one team emerged victorious. Gemma and Alvaro are officially the winners of House Rules New Zealand. And welcome them, Alvaro and Gemma. Welcome to the project. Thanks for having us, guys. Um, there's been a bit of tension in the studio, fair to say, with you coming in. Now, Duncan's a great host. Mm. I would say way better than a grumpy ex-cricketer, would you think, in a renovation oh. show? Ooh. He definitely had a bit <laughs> more of a, a family-oriented... <laughs> For us. <laughs> <laughs> we love point. to have you. Well, if I was there, I sure as heck wouldn't have allowed the winners to donate twenty thousand dollars of their prize money. <laughs> what? Uh, That's not you? the spirit of reality <laughs> TV, did. is it? We did. We did. We came, but you came very close with Martinique and Andre, who were in the final with us, and it was just, you know, the right thing to do. It is three months that you are kind of without pay, basically, mm -hmm. um, renovating homes. So. We like, just wanted to make sure yeah. they were okay, really. Yeah, everyone sacrificed something to be there, and they just felt far too greedy to keep that whole hundred k. So you us. gave someone twenty thousand dollars. Yeah, you're, nice. yeah, you're cool. very, you're very good people. I I'm mean, a bit light. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> um, you no ended to away. up then with eighty thousand dollars paid off your mortgage. Mm. What is better, that or a totally renovated home? I think for us in our situation, probably the home was a better option. Um, we probably yeah. would have put the money towards renovating Doing the home. Right. Yeah. I mean, yeah, if you yeah. saw, we didn't have a shower. <laughs> we had a hole in the ground um, and we were showering at the gym <laughs> when the show first started. So our home was in a pretty serious need for a renovation. Yeah. Did you keep the sparkly blue wallpaper? It is still there. <laughs> <laughs> It won't be for long. Like, uh, once you finish doing so many houses, the last thing you want to do is renovate again. So yeah. we're bidding our time, but it's... They leave a little bit, yeah. though. Just, you know, <laughs> token. sentimental Yeah, we might, we might frame some somewhere. Yeah. In, in, defense <laughs> the the people, in defense of the people who put that wallpaper up, can we just revisit rule number one? You said you wanted them to fuse Scandi and Coastal in a modern way. It's very confusing. What? <laughs> no, no. Scandinavian and Coastal design are a thing. Yeah. yeah. Seems like it's... by that. <laughs> if, you go into, if you look at the Redo Week and what we did, we essentially showed what we were all about. Yeah. And, and our rules were pretty much lending themselves to very light tones and, like, earthy tones is what right. we asked for. Any Not justification for... <laughs> Fuse, Scandi and Coastal sounds like instructions for a murder mystery drama. <laughs> <laughs> Not a renovation. Yeah. Yeah. I've got a little bit of experience with these types of Here shows. we go. Uh, and, and I know that it can be tough, you know, on, on one's relationship. Um, you know, the stress that you put under, the, uh, everything that goes with it. But you guys still seem quite happy. I think we um, stand our <laughs> dynamic. Yeah. We're going to put it up a front as well. <laughs> <laughs> no, you know, it's actually a really nice experience. We never get to spend, you know, much the day together. together, really, or to see each other in that kind of environment. And I actually think we, we understand each other so well and that was kind of our strength in the end. He, he would lift me up when I was down and vice versa and Aww. I think that kind of played in our favour in the end. Um, any temptation to do this for a living, to flip houses, to go into old houses, turn them around and make some money off them? What do you think? I mean, for me, I'd say it is addictive. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I, I just know. need the backing of the money. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the hard part, I don't you know. know whether it is actually flipping houses that we're after, but we definitely enjoyed the whole renovation aspect of it and yeah. just, like, turning something old into something new. So I do see that Gemma has, like, a great eye for interior design. And if she I'd wanted... love more than five and a half days, though. I <laughs> 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 posed a challenge. Call it six and we've got a deal. Yeah. <laughs> hey, congratulations, guys. The show was a huge hit and you guys have been as well. It's uh, been uh, lovely to have you on tonight. Thanks so much. Thanks so much, guys. Gemma and Alvaro.